If you're from rural Illinois, chances are you have driven down roads with fields and fields of corn on either side of you. Did you know that this corn is not the same as the corn that you eat on the cob in the summer? That corn is called sweet corn and it only makes up 1% of all the corn grown in the United States. The corn you drive by all across Illinois is called field corn or dent corn and it's harvested when it's hard and dry and then ground up into feed for livestock, fuel for our vehicles, and all kinds of food products that we enjoy every day. Yes, even Cheetos. Nearly 10.5 million acres of Illinois farmland are used to grow field corn. But how does that corn get from those fields and onto our tables? How did corn get in my Cheetos? Let's head to one farm to learn more. <music> Hi class, my name is Shane Gray. I farm with my family here in Sangamon County, just outside our state capital, Springfield. We grow both corn and soybeans, and along with farming, we sell crop insurance, we run a trucking company, plus our family runs a grain elevator right over there. I understand you want to know how the corn we grow here on the farm ends up in your food. First off, let me explain, there's two types of corn. There's a sweet corn, which you're probably most familiar with, and then there's something that looks like this called field corn. Sweet corn, we usually harvest it when it's soft and moist and sweet. Field corn, we wait for it to mature, late fall, stalks dry, and it comes out hard and dry. The sweet corn is what we have, and we call corn on the cob. Field corn, if you were to take it home and boil it, it wouldn't matter how much butter or salt you put on it, you wouldn't like the taste of that. I want to focus a little bit on the field corn. This is what we grow here on our farm in Sangamon County. Field corn contains a great deal of starch. It's mostly starch with very little sugars. Whereas the sweet corn that we had mentioned earlier contains much more sugar and very little starch. What I want to do now is show you the process of how we grow this corn and how this ends up in cleaning products, fuels that run our cars and trucks, and in many cases, some of the other foods that we eat, whether it be chips, Cheetos, or whatever it may be. The first thing we have to do is we have to harvest the corn out of the field. We do that with a combine. Let's go for a ride. Hey, once we're in the combine, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go through and we're gonna pluck each ear of corn off each one of the stocks, and then this machine right here, it's gonna take each kernel off the cob throw it into a hopper on top of the combine, and then throw all of the rest of it, what we call trash, into the field. As you can see, these combines are amazing machines. They're gonna cut the stalk, strip the trash, and pluck each kernel off of the cob and separate it, doing all of that in a matter of seconds. Once the combine's full, then we have to put the corn that's in the combine into the semi-truck to take it to the market. Well class, we're back to the field with an empty truck, ready to do that whole process all over again. Thanks for stopping by the farm. Hope you learned a little bit about uh, field corn, and now you know the whole story. Mm -hmm.